Hello everyone and welcome to episode 3 of my dream note series. Today is all about secondary page. Now this was great. Oh my god. Dream notes. They are really impressing me album after album. I'm not gonna lie, I wanted more songs <laughs> because I was having such a great time, but it always feels so short to me, which is why I'm not a biggest fan of like single album, anything with less than five songs, because I know that when I really enjoy the content, it starts to feel very short and it just frustrates me because it's so good, but then there's not enough of it. So um, I love the album. It's phenomenal. Definitely a contender for best project ever. The only reason why I'm not calling it my favorite is just because there's not a lot of songs in it. If there was like five, six songs, this might have been my number one album. But it's definitely a contender for that. I love their energy throughout the album. It's definitely the type of albums where once the start the wow the song start playing you can't control your body anymore it's just going to dance and move on its own accord because you can't resist the melody you can't resist trying to sing along even though you may not even know the lyrics at that point um it's fun it's good and perfect for a 5 p.m playlist after a long day just listening to this type of music will definitely make your energy go up now, when it comes to my personal favorites, I have two of them in this album. Number two is Broken. Don't 
Now, the star of the album is Blue. I feel so blue, feel so blue. I'm singing along. That's my blue. favorite song on the album. Now, it's so interesting to me how different Lemonade and Blue are, but they're one after the other on the album. So at the beginning of the video, I mentioned how it, the album was like fun and, you know, you can't resist to move your body. That's more so Lemonade. And broken to an extent is also something that you can just vibe to. But blue is definitely all about the feels. But when you listen to the album, you get the fun from Lemonade and then you get a song like Blue, which is a complete diff a completely different vibe altogether, but it works because Broken is like a mix of those two vibes. The one, the happy vibe that you get from Lemonade and then the one, the emotional one that you get from this one. So I just love how this album is so interesting and I'm really impressed by the quality of music I've experienced so far from them. Let me know in the comments how you thought about this album, which song ended up your favorite, and if you want more, check out their dedicated playlist on the channel. 